Hey everyone, this is Paul from Axure. In this video, I'm going to walk you through many of the new features found in Axure 6.5. Let's get started. Rotate a widget by selecting it, placing the mouse over a corner, then holding Control on the PC or Command on the Mac. Click and drag. You can also rotate widgets by entering a degree of rotation in the formatting tab of the Widget Properties pane. Create links from text in your wireframe. Highlight the text and click the hyperlink icon in the toolbar. Double click a page to quickly create a link in your prototype. If you want your link to open in a new tab or you want to add other actions, select the text, click the hyperlink icon, and then select Open Case Editor. Pin to Browser allows you to create a static element which stays in place when you scroll, otherwise known as CSS Fixed Positioning. Convert the widgets you want to be fixed into a dynamic panel. Right-click and select Edit Dynamic Panel, Pin to Browser. Check the checkbox to activate the setting. Position the panel using horizontal and vertical positioning with margins. By default, the pin panel will always stay in front. Assign a button to be clicked when Enter is pressed in a text field. Select the text field, right click, and choose Edit Text Field, Assign Submit Button. In this dialog, select the button you want to be clicked when the Enter key is pushed. Create a page scrolling animation using the action Scroll to Image Map Region. Add an image map region to the point in your page you want to scroll to and label it. Add an event to a widget and choose the action Scroll to Image Map Region. Select the image map you'd like to scroll to and choose an animation in the drop list. Dynamic panels can be set to their next and previous state for easy slideshows or mobile swiping. In the case editor, select Set Panel State to State, select the dynamic panel, and in the drop list, choose Previous or Next. You also have the option to wrap states, which makes your last state rotate back to the first and vice versa. Choose an animation and click OK. Share your generated prototype with clients and colleagues by uploading your RP file to ActShare. Select the ActShare icon in the toolbar. If you don't have an ActShare account, click Create an Account and set one up. The project name will generate in the name field and you can add a password here as well. Click Publish to start the upload. When it's done generating, you can view the prototype in your browser or copy the URL. Create realistic mobile interactions by adding onswipe left and onswipe right events to a dynamic panel. Let's set onswipe left to the next panel state with slide left animations. We'll set onswipe right to set the panel to the previous state with slide right animations. View mobile prototypes as if they were apps using these settings in the mobile section of the Generate Prototype dialog. Include viewport tag, hide address bar, prevent vertical page scrolling, add a home screen icon. On the iOS devices, create a splash screen, hide the browser nav when launched from the home screen, and customize the status bar. 
Upload your prototype to ActShare and open it. Click Show Links and Options, and then click on Link to open the page without the sitemap. This is the URL you need to view on your device for the mobile settings to take effect. Add this page to the home screen. The page name will generate as the title for the home screen icon. Open it up to view the splash screen. Notice the removed address bar and browser nav. These are features designed to help you work more efficiently in Axure. When dragging widgets, guides will appear and widgets will snap to the alignment of other widgets. Padding width can be found in the Snap to Objects settings. Similar to Snap to Objects, guides will appear and widgets will snap to the area surrounding other widgets. Pasting using right click of the mouse places the widget at the location of the mouse cursor. Right-clicking the wireframe gives you the option to select all of the widgets above or below the mouse cursor. Selecting Hide Unlabeled filters out unlabeled widgets when creating interactions. Use keyboard hotkeys to copy and paste cases. This concludes our video. For more information, go to axure.com slash newin65 or email us at support at axure.com.